The next sketch tool that we are going to cover is rectangles. Notice we have rectangle command in the ribbon, but first I'm gonna create a new sketch, select the front plane, and now I'm ready to start my rectangle. But once again, just like the line command, notice we have a drop down list, and this drop down list gives us five options for creating rectangles a corner rectangle, a center rectangle, three point corner rectangle, three point center rectangle and a parallelogram. We'll begin with the corner rectangle. Once I select the corner rectangle, notice the property manager opens. Now before we create a corner rectangle, notice the graphics here. They are very descriptive for a reason. Notice we see the points along with a number next to each point. The numbers represent the order that you select the points. So let's start with the corner rectangle. I'm gonna go out to the screen, select my first point, rubber band the rectangle out, which is stretching or moving the cursor in an outward direction, and then select my second point. And there's my corner rectangle. The next option is center rectangle. I'll select the center point first and then a corner point. So here's my center point and then the corner point. My third option is a three point corner rectangle. Notice one, two, and three. So I'll select my first point, my second point, and I'll rubber band the rectangle out and then locate my third point. The fourth option is center point, midpoint for one of the sides of the rectangle, and then a corner point. So here's my center point my midpoint, and then my corner point. The last option is parallelogram. And once again, notice the order of points. I'll select my first point, second point, and then my third point. I'm gonna go ahead and close out of the rectangle command. And I do wanna mention, when you're working in these ribbons here, anytime you see a drop down list, the last option that is used will be the option appearing in the ribbon. So for example, right now you see a corner rectangle in the ribbon. However, if I select a three point corner rectangle, and I go out to the screen and create a three point rectangle, close out of the rectangle command, notice the three point corner rectangle is the one that appears in the ribbon. And if we wanna have the corner rectangle reappear, we simply need to go back into the list, select corner rectangle, and then create a corner rectangle.